Hello, my fellow music lovers. Thanks for coming by one more time and uh, want to talk about Zeppelin. I think that uh, there's lots of hopes and dreams and prayers for these uh, guys to get back together again one more time. I don't think it's going to happen. I, I really don't. Uh, I think Plant is just too, um, well, planted into his own solo career, to be honest with you. Uh, he's, he's not as, as nostalgic as Page. Uh, Page will sit many hours in front of a console going over hours and hours of tapes to remaster things and re-release things and plant, you know, is more about, you know, working with his solo band and, and if he's going to do a Zeppelin song, he's going to do it in such a way almost like you can't even recognize it. You know, he has a whole nother take that he does and, you know, good for him if that's what he wants to do. He tries to keep things fresh. I've always appreciated that about Robert, Robert Plant. I've, I've always been a big fan of his solo career. There's been some times where I haven't been so crazy about some, uh, you know, albums that he's put out. But for the most part, I, I've really enjoyed following Plant, especially in the earlier days. You know, I loved Pictures at Eleven, his first solo album, uh, Principle of Moments, Shaken and Stirred was good, and um, Now in Zen, and... He's, he's had some really good stuff. And, you know, for the first few years when he toured as a solo act, he didn't do any Zeppelin. He avoided Zeppelin. And so, you know, Plant doesn't even, he barely does anything from the early years of his solo career. Like, I would love to hear him go back and do something from Pictures at Eleven, you know, Burning Down One Side, Worst in Detroit. Um, I would love to hear him go back. He won't even do that, let alone you know, reunite with Zeppelin. So um, I, I just think that that ship has sailed. I think that Jimmy Page needs to just, you know, get going on something. You know, he's not getting any uh, any younger. He needs to go out there and play with some other people and get these songs out. I mean, you know, Zeppelin is not going to fly as Zeppelin, but I think that Jimmy Page can certainly go out there and put a band out, out there that will pay respects to the Zeppelin catalog. I mean, he's already done it. You know, he did it with the Black Crows. Remember that back in 99? I, I got the chance to see them in New York. And that was a great show. I really enjoyed that. Um, he did an album with David Coverdale. Um, he worked with, uh, with Paul Rogers and The Firm. And he even put out a decent solo album back in the 80s, uh, Out, Outrider. Uh, and then, of course, he toured with... Plant. They did a whole page in Plant. They did many shows and they put an album out. And uh, I think that Page just needs to get with somebody and go out and kick ass while he still has time. And, you know, let's just put this Zeppelin thing with Plant behind him. It's not going to happen. I, I I really don't think so. They uh, The last show that they did was killer. And I think that they needed to do that because every other reunion that Zeppelin had uh, after they broke up in 1980 has been a disaster practically. I mean, Live Aid was awful. So much so that the band uh, won't even allow the footage out. Like, they didn't put it on the Live Aid DVD because they, it's so bad. Um, they reunited in the late 80s for uh, Atlantic Records. They, they, they did a set that was actually not that bad, the problem was the sound was kind of off. The mix was very, very poor. Um, and it didn't really come off all that uh, well. But but when they got back for the show at the O2 Arena about 10 or so years ago, that kicked ass. And I'm glad that they captured that and put it out. And if that's the last thing that we ever get, then then great. I would not hold out hope for Zeppelin. And it's kind of a shame. You know, it's like we, we got these guys. They could do it. We're losing bands, it seems. They're starting to fall off the map, you know. Uh, Pink Floyd is gone. Skinnerd is gone. The Police are gone. Who else is gone? Rush, sadly, has just wrapped things up. And, uh, and then you could make the case there's a lot of bands out there that probably should be gone, but they're not, you know. Um, you know <clears throat> Kiss, but, you know. What are you going to do? What do you think? You think Zeppelin's ever going to fly again? Should they? Do you think Plan is being a, a jackass for not getting back and giving it one more spin, or should we just let it let it go? Put your comments down below. I'm curious to see what you have to say, and uh, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And uh, and I'll talk to you soon. All right, take care.